Yo guys, what's up? Scammer Vaults here, and today we call another douchebag retarded scammer parts. And uh, yeah, basically he logged into the freaking website again, and you can see all these payments here. Unfortunately, I can't do anything with it, but he did log in with a password and an email account, so I'm gonna try and get the password off of here, and I'm going to put it in the description for you guys. So if you guys want to see that, if I got the password, it will be in the description. As you can tell, their website is so crap they don't even have icons. And the freaking up button for the website just brings you to an error. So, yeah, I don't know. But yeah, so totally call these guys. I have three numbers in the description for you guys to call. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Okay, but they sent it on my phone. Okay. So let me help you fix the problem, sir. It's a desktop or it's a laptop? It's a desktop. Okay. Now, could you please look on the keyboard and look on the left bottom corner? Okay. You see a Windows button, Windows key. It has a four little square. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So press and hold the Windows key down. Okay. And while holding it down, press the letter R as in Romeo at the same time. All right, I did that. I came up with the little run box. Yeah. Now let go Windows and R, sir. Release both the button, Windows and R. And just right there in the little open box, these. You know, it says open. It says open. Yeah, it just said that. And you see the box is blank or... So it's a blank box or you see something in there? It's a blank box. Blank box, okay. Now could you please type in the box or type letter I as in indigo. E as in echo. Okay. X as in x-ray. Okay. P as in Peter. Alright. L as in Lima. Okay. O as in Oscar. Okay. R as in Romeo. Okay. E as in Echo. Uh-huh. Then put a space. Okay. And then type www dot. Okay. Fast, F A S T fast. Okay. Support. Yeah. U P P O R T support. And uh -huh. that's one word. Yeah, I can spell support. Okay. Yep. Dot com. Alright. It should be I explore space www dot fast support dot com. Yeah, that's what I got. Yeah. Now click on OK, hit OK. Alright. And this will. Open a new window on the screen, fastsupport.com. Yeah. Or establish support connection page. Yeah, that's what it did. Yeah, see the box there, sir? Now type your name in and I'll give you the support key. Okay. Alright, I got my name in. Okay. Enter support key. Okay. Okay, six, I'm sorry, two, six, three. Two, six, three. Six seven one. Six seven one. Two six four. Two six four. Yeah. All right. All right, I got that in. Then hit. Yeah. Click continue. Okay. Okay, it says connecting. Now, now it's got a message box. Session. Yeah, Ricky Winston. It's me. Say yes. Okay, I clicked yes. Okay. There we go. I have a okay, I have a question. Who exactly are you guys again? Hey, it's Microsoft's technician, sir. I mean, like, what company? Subcontracted. I'm sorry. I said, I mean, like, like, what company are you guys? This is uh, Microsoft subcontracted, sir. Microsoft company. So you're saying you're Microsoft? Yes, sir. We are Microsoft. We are okay. subcontracted. All right. Okay, just. And that's why we can see using Windows version on it, which is why uh, we got, you know, we've been notified from server that some bad IP address they're trying to get connected to your network. Oh, okay. So from, let me run a scan from the on the server? And see what that thing is here. Just one minute. Okay. So what's this that you're Windows doing here? 10 .0. I'm sorry? What's this that you pulled up here? Uh, I didn't quite hear you, sir. I'm sorry. What did you say? I said, what's this that you pulled up here? Uh, 
I just cannot hear you, sir. I'm sorry. What is this that you pulled up on the screen? Oh, okay. I'm sorry. So this is a screen where I'm going to scan the computer. Oh, okay. See what? Yep. Connections. We are here. So just right. one minute. Let me scan the network. Just one second. We got Windows 10 on it. Windows version 10 and. Are you the only user of this computer, or somebody else also uses it? Uh, I'm the only user. Okay. So this is what I see here right now, sir. Do you see here? It says uh, current connections six. Okay. Yep. So that's the uh, unwanted connections uh, you know found in your network, and that's what we've been notified from our server. Okay. Now, how many devices are connected? So, is this the only computer you got, or you got multiple computers, or? No, this is the only computer I have. Okay, it should not be more than one or two. Do you also have a smartphone connected to your this network, or any other device like tablet, iPad? Uh, I have a smartphone. Now, these are the active connections here. The active connections. The local address that's supposed to be the IP address of this computer, physical address, which belongs to it. All right. Foreign address, they are the unknown IP address. They're not part of this computer. And I see, you see, one is established and the others are showing here time wait, time wait. Okay. So this is how the, the IP address got hacked and the network got compromised. So this is what we have found here. Oh, my and network got hacked? Yes, sir, it's a network. Right okay. now, see there's one IP address, foreign address has been established with a local address. Okay. Just one second. So this is what you got, sir, earlier about this safety alert. Uh, yeah, I've gotten that a few times. I usually just make a new tab. Okay. So you never call. This is the first time you're calling, sir? You did not call before? You are not called before? No, you guys sent me a message on my phone. This is the first time I've called you. Okay. All right. Just one minute, sir. I'll make the checks on our computer, yeah? Just one second. And how old this machine is? How old is it? Uh, it's about maybe two years now. Got it in 2015. 1 minute, sir, yeah? Alright. And your name again, sir, is um, Harold James? No, my name's Edward. James Harold? Edward, okay. And your computer name is Tommy? Yeah, so I got this from my brother. Okay, all right. I see there are a lot of infections running in the computer, Mr. Sorry. Uh, Edward, you see here there's a lot of infections are running in the computer. It says warning, warning, eight, 1,859 warnings are running in the computer. And I see there are a lot of infections that got in today. Okay. See this critical warning error It's all of the infections. So how do we fix now it? See, yeah, we gotta clean this up. Uh, the infection is not running, and I see this has been it's been there for a while. It's not just started doing today. Oh, okay. Stalling it down. 
that it shows the computer is getting these warnings on a regular basis every day. Okay, just for one minute. So I'm looking at the services of the computer and it shows that only few services are running. All okay. these yeah, service applications should be running. So how do we fix and it? And here's Windows Defender is running. Software protection that has stopped working. So how do so we, we fix we it? We need to make all these services running. But to fix this, so we need to install a protection in a network. Okay. What I found here is, you do not have a network protection which should be preventing your network from third party access or unknown connections. All or right. you have a virus protection on this computer, Windows Defender is running. Which is an inbuilt Microsoft security which secures your computer from virus and you have the CC cleaner. Okay. So your computer is good for, you know, it's, you, you have a good protection for virus and malware, but there's no network protection. We're not, we're not, we know we're going to install it on a network. These, this network install, this network protection, which is a secure socket layer. All right. What's this? Your computers keep alerting, you see here? It says your computer has been blocked. Okay. Just one minute. Which browser do you use on it? Uh, Chrome, you use Opera, or you use... I usually use Chrome. Chrome? Okay, this is the protection I'm talking about, secure socket layer. It is a standard security technology for establishing an encrypted link between a web server and browser. So right. this link ensures that all data passed between the web server and browser remain private and integral. Okay, how much is all this gonna cost? Okay, well, there's no cost to diagnose the problem, no cost to clean up the computer. The only thing is the secure socket layer, which I'm talking about, which is not running. It's never been installed in your network. And okay. it has a secure link, which secures all your data, everything. It, it creates a secure link between the web server, which is your network, and your browsers like your Chrome, Opera, Explorer. So whatever you do over the internet, it doesn't get exposed. Your password, everything. Okay. I'll make the detailed report and tell you that here what needs to be done. Or we will get it fixed because I'm running a little bit low on time. I'm sorry, and when was the last time it was uh, fixed or it was cleaned up by someone? Never. Never? Okay. By the way, we're gonna do it now. We, it will take us about 40 to 50 minutes to fix this problem. Okay. So can I just pay right now and you guys can fix it? Uh, well, you don't have to be on the phone during this time, Edward. You can just leave it on us, uh, you know, we'll work remotely. Once the work is done, I'll have my technician call you. The only thing is, uh, we need to install this protection, including this work. We got to protect your network, install this network security, which is a SSL, secure. Okay, can we do that? I'm sorry, what? Can we do that right now? Yeah, we'll do it now. So I could just get the and payment over with? I'm sorry, what? So I could just get the payment over with. As I said, uh, Edward, there's no cost to diagnose the problem. Yeah, but you said SSL you know, costs money, right? Yeah, SSL costs Yeah, so can we just okay. do that one first? Well, the barely... Okay, the minimum protection for this secure socket layer, SSL, which covers everything, all your devices and secures all your website, your email, social networking, banking, okay? This cost you $199.99 for the three years. 
protection and there's a five years protection which cost you about $299.99. Oh yeah, I'll do the five years. You want to go with the five years one? Yeah. Okay, well, I'll get, get yourself registered for the five years one, Edward. Now, right. just one minute. Okay, to do it, billing team would require to get yourself registered. They would require your information like a name and your billing address. Weren't you guys able email. to do that through Microsoft's website? I'm sorry, what? Aren't you able to do that on the website instead of on here? You can do it on website. It's a third party security, Edward. You already got a Microsoft security on a computer, Windows Defender. Okay, can we do it it's on the starting. website? I just feel a little bit better doing it on the website. On a website? Yeah. Well, website, we cannot buy this from website because it's, it's well, you not said, registered. You said you guys were Microsoft. Microsoft. Yes, I am. I'm a Microsoft certified technician, I said. Yeah, so can I pay so through contract. the website? I don't really want to put my stuff all on here. Well, you're not, you don't have to give out any information. You don't have to put any information on website like your card well, number. I'm giving you my name, my billing address, my phone number. Well, it's just to... Okay, to give you the documents, the service, we are buying it from a third party company. Okay, that can company we do it? Doc. Can we do it through their website? I just feel safer doing it on the website, you know? Well, website, I can open the website here. You want to yeah. do it on the website? Yeah. Okay, just one. Security, which is we are going to buy from this company. Just one minute. Let me log into the page and then And then what? Just a second I said let me log into the page. Okay. I got a question for you. How do you like scamming people? Uh, Thanks what? for logging in for me. Now I can refund all these people. Wow, look at all this money you've been stealing from people. You stupid, stupid scammer. Look at all this. Look at Visa, $149, $215, $299, $211, $299, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $215, $
uh, services that were are set on like to turn on when they need to and you said that they were all stopped and that's an error now you're talking about like oh god you're so stupid bro why are you so stupid you know this because that's a reality Richard. that's a reality tax id hey. chargeback day man I look at all these success all these sad people taking all their money huh Well, as I said, it's a mutual agreement. We do not force anybody to a buy anything. Mutual agreement. If somebody agrees, then okay. If somebody agrees to buy a software for their for their network, their computer, then what can we do about it? Uh. Making a blog. Well, you're to, scamming people. Uh, a blog. I'm making a YouTube video. I mean, keep talking your crap. People are just gonna make fun of you more in the comments. What? What? You don't know what a comment section is? Comment section? I'm uh, sorry, I didn't hear that part, I'm sorry. Well, it seems like you don't know how to hear anything here. Okay, what's your, what, what's your number on the website? Let's see. Oh, you guys got two numbers? Oh, cool. I'll copy this one now. What number? You guys got two numbers on your website, huh? And you got this nice two little numbers, number that you gave me here. So, uh, you got 855-366-2200. Then you got one eight four four three one three eight two seven seven, and then you have one eight four 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 one four four five zero. Why do you have so many numbers? I don't know. You know, it doesn't belong to us. I don't know what number you're talking about. Oh, the the number on your website because you're not Microsoft. You guys don't even have a copyright date. It just says copyright. By N2 Systems. Let's see who's that. Oh, wow, you guys don't even know how to put a website in. I'm sorry, what are you doing? Where are you putting this information on? It doesn't even work. Website, posting a blog. I'm gonna put it on YouTube. For everybody YouTube? to call you. Yeah. People don't watch this kind of stuff on YouTube, you know? Oh, yeah, they do. I have over 600,000 views on my channel. Plenty of people watch it. They rather like. They rather like some a Lady Gaga show or. Mini minutes, so. Well, they're gonna hear you saying this right now. If you can put those kind of videos, people will enjoy. Well, enjoy getting a crap ton of calls and your number shut down. Bye. Well, I guess that's it for this guy. Uh, yeah, very stupid. Um, if I get the password, I'll put it in the description for you guys, and I'll put the email in the description too. And that, see you guys later. Peace.